Hey guys, Tech Mentor with a video for you guys. In today's video, I want to show you how to fix your phone if audio message is not working for you. So generally, if you go into your messages and you're trying to text someone an audio message, you go over there, click on it, and you press and hold this option here, and it'll let you kind of record an audio message like that, and you'll be able to send it. But sometimes you might get a pop-up message like this where it's not allowing you to send that audio message. It might not record even to a point where you might receive an audio message and you can't even hear the audio message. So here's a couple things you can do to fix that. So let's get started. So first thing you want to do whenever you're troubleshooting is go into your settings, right? And in the settings here, you want to go find your messages settings. In the messages setting, you need to ensure that iMessage is active and turned on. And you can see the option here. Make sure this message here it is turned on and it is activated. As you can see, it's waiting for activation. That means not on yet. It has to either show your email address or your phone number there. So you want to make sure it's on just like that. That means iMessage is working for you. So that's the first thing you want to check out. The next thing you want to do is quickly from the top menu here for the control center here, we're going to turn on airplane mode for a moment. And then after we turn it on, we're going to turn it back off. And all it does is a quick refresh of your network set. Uh, like your cellular or if you have Wi-Fi connection that sometimes that helps because the reason why the audio message works is that it's through your internet so if you're sending it through Wi-Fi or if you have cellular data if it's not working correctly audio message will not be accessible because that's how iMessage works now after you have done that the next thing you want to do if it's still not working is hop over to settings now this time in settings what you'll do is go to accessibility and accessibility you want to go down into the hearing section where it says sound recognition. Now, sound recognition allows you know, the phone to listen for certain sounds and alert you, but this can also interfere with audio messages as you're trying to record an audio message. So go ahead and turn that off and see if your audio message is working now for you. Generally, this setting is turned off, but if you have it turned on for it, I would recommend turning it off and testing it out and see what happens. Now, after you have done that and you're still having the issue, the next thing you can do is a force restart of your phone. And to do a force restart, all you're going to do is press the volume up and then volume down and then hold the side button on your right hand side just like that. Again, make sure you help press and release the volume up and down really quick and then hold the side button on your right hand side. And it's going to ask you to slide power up, but don't do anything. Just keep on holding that side button like we have it here till you see the screen goes completely black and the Apple logo reappears at that time you're going to let go and then wait for the phone to reboot up and all it's doing is a nice clean reboot of the phone so that the phone can have a fresh start again this will not delete any of your personal data like photos videos app apps or anything like that all it's doing is just reloading the code and making sure if there's any software issues impacting your phone to not work correctly it will resolve those issues now after you have done that the next thing you want to do if it's still not working is go into your settings and go to general and look for the software update here and then you're going to make sure that your phone is up to date with the latest version of the software. And the reason why that is is a previous update might have broken the functionality or there's a bug or some issue going on. You want to make sure your phone is up to date with the latest version and it helps to fix any sort of issue that you might be having with the software here. And if there's an update out for your phone, it will say give you the update and some details. And then you can click on download and install. When you're doing the installation, do remember this generally can take up to 45 minutes or even longer when you're doing this update make sure you're connected to a good Wi-Fi or cellular data connection and that your phone is at least 50 percent or more charged to successfully install the update now after you have done that it's still not working the next thing to do is come back to your settings here and this time we're going to go general and then scroll all the way down here with this transfer reset iPhone we're going to click on that reset option here the very first one and once you click on it, you see a menu pop up. But the reset that we're going to be looking to do is the very first one, which is uh, reset all settings. This generally takes two to three minutes. But before you do that, can understand what this does. Well, this will reset things like network settings. So if you have saved passwords, VPN settings, keyboard uh, reset as well. If you added stuff to the dictionary, like certain uh, certain uh, keywords and such. Also, things like your home screen layout will be adjusted to back to factory setting, and then also any settings around location and privacy. None of this will actually delete your personal data, like photos, videos, apps, anything like that. All it's doing is resetting the settings themselves. So if a setting got messed up somehow, preventing audio message from not working, it will resolve it. Again, you'll do the reset all settings, 
Again, we'll take two to three minutes and after that, hopefully your phone is working. So that's all for the troubleshooting steps that you can do if your audio message is not working. Hopefully you guys found this video helpful and one of the solution worked for you. If so, please make sure that like and subscribe button. And we also want to hear from you if you found a better solution to your problem with audio message not working. Leave a comment in the comment section. And thanks for watching guys. We'll see you guys in the next video.